Good evening, everybody. I have the honor of being the first of 10 to go through this, so I'll try to keep this as quick as possible. My name is Ian. I'm from the University of Cambridge, and I'm from the Department of Politics and International Studies. Our project has been, in the past one, uh, past quarter, has been looking at innovative financing mechanisms to support WASH. I think this is a very salient point, given that many people have been talking about resource mobilization, particularly around domestic resource mobilization. And I think you know, innovative financing mechanisms will be one of the ways that this can be done. Just as a primer and a quick one at, at that, there are kind of three insights from our study. But uh, b before I go into that, innovative financing mechanisms for many of you here, I'm quite sure you're familiar with it. But there are kind of four major approaches to that. The first is on mobilizing public revenue. That is about looking at how you can improve solidarity taxes, are looking at lotteries, insurance funds to actually increase the domestic revenue. The second is on paying for performance. We've heard a lot today about public-private partnerships. The third is on reducing costs and promoting innovation. Uh, that goes around providing microfinance to households to support household-level wash, providing advanced market commitments, which Gavi is doing at the moment. And finally, on the fourth approach is on working with development partners, uh, most, most of the time in multilaterals, to look at leveraging debt 